I hear KFC's got a donut chicken sandwich. Well, it's not available in Chicago, so we're gonna hack the menu today. So come along and uh, let's see what we can do. What's up YouTube, Big Daddy here. It's time for another food review. So the story is that KFC uh, is test marketing a sandwich somewhere in the United States. I'm thinking, I thought I heard North Carolina. Don't sue me if I'm wrong. But <clears throat> what they're doing is they're, they've come up with a sandwich which basically puts uh, chicken in between two glazed donuts. Uh, and that's their new product that they're marketing. And the whole idea is they're wanting to see if there is a market for it in the United States. So I guess, you know, as most test markets go, if it sells really well there in the middle of the United States or somewhere in a state in the United States, hopefully they'll roll it out to other areas of the country and eventually it'll become nationwide. <clears throat> Probably some kind of limited offer because I can't see them putting in that on their menu full time. But you never know. Well, it doesn't take a genius to figure out that... Okay, uh, KFC sells a chicken sandwich. It's called the Crispy Colonel. Uh, Dunkin' Donuts sells glazed donuts. What if I were to take two glazed donuts from Dunkin' Donuts and put it together with KFC's Crispy Colonel and uh, yeah, so we're going to hack the menu and come up with our own because who needs to wait for KFC? I don't need to wait for KFC. It's a donut sandwich. Donuts is the bread and chicken in the middle. That's it. From what I understand, there's not even any new sauce or no condiments or nothing. It's just breaded chicken fried and donuts. So let's do it. Let's get a little close-up action and we'll build it ourselves okay guys so here's my crispy kernel sandwich I simply ordered it plain there's my chicken breast so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this bread off we're gonna take the chicken patty we're gonna put it on top of this piece of, of this donut we're gonna take this bread we're gonna get that out of here we're gonna take this other donut we're gonna place it on top and there you now have a KFC chicken sandwich with two glazed donuts as buns it's that easy that's it that's that's the whole thing that's the whole test market uh unless kfc releases some more information about like they're gonna put sauce or they're gonna build some proprietary donut that has some kind of secret spiciness to it or the breading has something pretty much it's a chicken patty with two glazed donuts, and that's the whole deal. So, let's put the camera back and let's try this. We'll stuff this in our pie hole and see what we think. All right, guys. So, here is our KFC chicken sandwich on two glazed donuts. So, now that we've made enough stupid faces, <laughs> let's, let's just stuff it in the pie hole and try it and see if KFC is on to something. I've heard of other people doing burgers with donuts, never a chicken sandwich. Here we go, KFC hacked 
chicken sandwich on two glazed donuts from Dunkin'. Let's do this. Hmm. You get the sugary sweetness from that, those glazed donuts, and you get the salty juiciness from the chicken sandwich. It definitely has a, a chicken and waffle kind of feel to it. I mean, there's no syrup. It's not a syrupy thing. Um, but I do kind of like it. It does go nicely together. Let's try another bite. Hmm. Now, I mean, it's nothing crazy. It's nothing over the top. I'm going to air down. Like, it's nothing sensational or over-the-top crazy. Like, it's not the best thing I ever ate. Um, and I know it's KFC's way, or hopefully, maybe KFC's way of getting their uh, chicken sandwich into the chicken sandwich war. Um, by the way, I got glazed on all over my fingers. But, it's, it's not too bad. Um... On a scale of 1 to 10, I would give this an 8. As is. Donut, chicken, done. That's it. No mayo, no sauce, no nothing. Now, if they were to put some kind of sauce, maybe put some spice, maybe if they're going to make their donuts and the donuts are going to have some kind of flavoring or there might be some kind of spicy kick on the back end, that would really put it over the top, make it next level. Um, maybe add some kind of uh, uh, toppings to this to go with the chicken on the donut. That would also help a lot. But as it stands, it's not too bad. Um, so I could see how certain people would want to buy this and try and, and at least try it once. You know, and you figure KFC's got a lot of restaurants. If everybody who goes to KFC has, tries it at least once, it's probably a winning item. It probably would be a limited run, but it wouldn't be a uh, an everyday menu item. But it's not too bad. So if you want to do this, this is exactly what I did. I went to Dunkin' Donuts and I got myself two glazed donuts. Two glazed donuts at Dunkin' in Chicago cost $2.99. Uh, I went to KFC and I ordered the Crispy Kernel Sandwich which cost me $3.99. I ordered the crispy kernel sandwich plain. I just said I would just want the meats and the bun. That's it. That way I don't have to mess and it was exactly somewhat accurate to what their test market was. And then I, you saw how I built it. I just took the meat off the bun and put it on the donut and now you got yourself the same thing. I have also seen people try to do the same thing by ordering chicken tenders and putting two tenders together for me personally, I think with the tenders, you kind of ruin a little bit of the continuity of the sandwich. You know, it's not one solid piece of meat. I don't know if the tenders have more seasoning or different seasoning. Plus the meat, the thickness on the crispy kernel sandwich uh, has a nice uh, meat thickness. And I think that would probably be what they'll probably do uh, if they were to bring this out to everybody. Something similar to that. I can't see them putting a skinny piece of meat between these giant donuts. So that's pretty much it, guys. If you want to hack the menu, too, or if you've tried doing this, too, leave me comments down below. If you think this sounds crazy, leave me comments down below, too. Uh, you know, if you think I'm full of it, hey, whatever. I don't care. I love to see those comments. And please share this video. Like, share, subscribe. Tell your friends and neighbors. And uh, remember, before you take the first bite, you got to stuff it in your pie hole. Mm. Yummy.